My name is Tom Hogan, and we're at Bernard's Bar at the beautiful Waldorf Astoria Hotel in Chicago. I work in the same way as far as cocktails, as I do in a lot of ways with uh, my art practice, which is sculpture. So starting with a relative feeling or, uh, or material, and then deciding which way if the idea is going to define the material or the material is going to define the idea. So using an ingredient in a way that reflects an idea or using an idea and then finding the ingredient that reflects appropriately. The cocktail is the foreigner. The foreigner, I derived the name from the word walnut. So walnut is derived from the Germanic and English, Old English word wall coming from the German word foreign and nut, N-U-T-H, I believe is how it's actually spelled uh, in the Old English. So it just means foreign nut, basically. So I started with two ounces of the pig's nose. Uh, blended scotch, and then a half an ounce of the Carpano Antica sweet vermouth, half an ounce of Tawaka, which is our vanilla and citron liqueur, and then we have a walnut liqueur, which I do make in house, and then a quarter of an ounce of my house made bitters. Then I'll stir the cocktail. I wanted to feature scotch because I really think it's what this bar really kind of is defined by. It, or we have a unique sipping collection from our whiskeys. Uh, but scotch is so rarely used in cocktails, so I really wanted to start there and uh, kind of put that as a feature on our menu. So from there, I was like, where are we in as far as seasonality? We have walnuts, it's since they're year round, and it's something that still gives you that warm winter feel uh, without being too Christmassy as well. So I decided to make the walnut liqueur from that juncture, and then from there adding the tuaca was more to like soften the sweet vermouth, so I wasn't using as much sweet vermouth, which would give that bitter quality and more cinnamon notes. Um, so it's just balancing as, as I go. And then I strain into the coupe glass. And I flame the uh, it's walnut bitters over the top to give you that smoky walnut flavor, and then uh, place a house made candied uh, walnut, which I make in house myself. And this is the foreigner.